guys, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I am going to review the Ramoa Classic Luggage. Yes, I did get it customized. And then also the Ramoa Original Luggage. No, I recently visited Japan last month. When I was packing for this trip, I knew I was going to purchase a lot, so I actually left one of my check-in luggages empty. However, it wasn't enough. <laughs> I brought two Ramoa check-in luggages with me and then also a Herschel Supply duffel bag and also a Herschel backpack. However, I bought so much stuff that I didn't realize that I would actually need more room. I had to choose between getting a check-in luggage and also a carry-on luggage. Although the check-in luggage can definitely fit more things in there, I knew that I was going to use the carry-on luggage a lot more. So one of the reasons why I purchased this luggage was because I have been wanting a Ramoa luggage for quite some time now. I do travel a lot flying to and from Disneyland and right now I currently have a CalPAC luggage. When we were in Japan, we saw that you can actually customize the Ramoa Classic luggage, which is what I did. It did cost a little extra to customize the luggage, but I figured, hey, why not? We're here, we're in Japan, I really wanted something special, so I just decided to get it customized. Now I'm gonna give you guys a closer look on my customized Ramoa Classic luggage and also show you guys the Ramoa Original. So let's get to it. So this is the Ramoa Classic luggage that I also got customized. As you can see here, the wheels are different and so are the straps and also the luggage tag. The straps on the Classic Ramoa luggage are um, detachable. As you can see here. And then the Ramoa Classic has this classic lock here. I also decided to get the Ramoa luggage um, strap here because they did have it available. When we were in Japan, they had a whole bunch of different colors and I am so, so happy that I was able to get one. And I also got the custom wheels and I chose this peach color. And also a luggage tag that has my initials on it in baby blue. They did have a few different colors for the wheels and also for the um, the handles here, but I thought these were super cute. And then this is the Ramoa Original. This one, you cannot change the straps, but the straps are so good because it kind of retracts like this. The differences between these two luggages is also the locks on here. So this one has like the, the lock is like that. You can open it that way. But this one is like the classic lock, like that. Both of these luggages are the same size. However, the shape is a little different. The Ramoa original has this rounded corner here and then the classic is actually a little bit more square there. So this one is not customizable. You could probably change the wheels, but definitely not the straps. And then this one, you could change the wheels and the strap. This is the inside of the Ramoa Classic luggage. And since I did get it customized, it's cool that they actually give you the original wheels that it comes with and also the straps, which is really cool. So this luggage, like I said earlier, is a carry-on, so you could fit probably like a week or a weekend's worth of clothes, depending on how you pack. And then this is the inside of the Ramoa Original luggage. Pretty much the same size. This is a top view of both of the luggages. This is actually my husband's Louis Vuitton um, luggage tag. And I have that one. So this one they did print it out for me at the store and they actually did include the original tag which is black. Kinda lift it up. And this is what it looks like. This is what it looks like from top view. I absolutely love Ramoa luggages just because of how um, sleek the design is and also when it spins, it's just like, oh, it's so, oh, <laughs> it's so smooth, so soft. 
I absolutely love it. So that is the comparison between the Ramoa Classic and the Ramoa Original. And that's it for today's video. If you guys did like this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't yet, subscribe to my channel. Follow me on Instagram at Ashton Like Kutcher and let me know in the comment section what other videos you guys would love to see. And I will see you next time. Bye!